likelihood of committing suicide is, is increased wow. by sleep deprivation. And in fact, at one of the local high schools, there's a great, great concern because there have been a couple of suicides. And it turns out the students were losing a lot of sleep, staying up at night. And that's that, very good for people to know because I didn't know that. And that's. Oh, yeah. Lo sleep loss has a negative effect on mood in general. <gasps> or sometimes, sometimes you get kind of like silly, but more likely you get you depressed. Get depressed and you Would feel, you get anxious? Or not? Well, I think the anxiety it would depend on you know the demands of the environment, but but you definitely uh, become depressed. And, you know. So and if you have that sleep debt you were talking about, where you haven't paid back the sleep debt, it can lead to a form of depression. Well, yeah. If if in fact, and it depends. On, I mean, that's you can't take an individual and say if I sleep deprive them, they will become suicidal. Right. I mean, there has to be other tendencies, but but uh, sleep loss definitely fosters that. What you know, other I, emotional effects I think, does it I have? I think the local high schools are now yeah. very concerned about homework, you know, because you, you go to school, you got to go get up, I don't know, some of the schools start very, very early, like you have to be up at six o'clock, then you have homework till midnight or something and the students don't get enough sleep. So what would you tell educators and school be districts very, about that? Be very careful about planning homework do not overdo it you know be cognizant of the amount of sleep students are getting and you know encourage them to get more sleep because students tend to stay up at night there's all night television i can remember when uh we used to hear the star spangled banner at whatever it was midnight or 11 and that was it there's nothing else to do right go to bed, but now it's all night. It's a 24-hour day. And the computers and stuff computers, like that. Computers, the internet. Texting. The, texting. And we we actually asked a local high school how many students were awakened by text at night, and it was like 70%. And how would that affect their sleep? Negatively, well, it, right? Yeah, they would lose sleep.